I am not ignoring my whips. They're ripening in my mental cellar. And they're almost done. Y'all, my friend decided to investigate what was blocking their drain system. And you are not prepared for the answer. This is a fallen angel to me. Louis Calhoun, in 1904, is well known for his 13-foot-long beard, which he used to hold cats in. That's it. That's the guy I want to be. Although I feel like one topic has a much stronger beard for this than I do. You attract what you fear. Um, a rich benefactor who will fund all my weird creative endeavors. No, stay away. Went outside and saw a bat flying around. And then I saw a toad in the yard. Straight up like a witch's brew out there. Stay safe. Can we please get a dragon? Mm-mm-mm. You already have the dungeon part. Don't get greedy now. Sorry, I never reply. Every day is blending together and I'm losing sense of time. Amy, I get it. Do not let the moose lick your car. Do, do they expect me to stop him somehow? I was born at a very young age. I've been alive for as long as I can remember. And I hope to continue living until I die. And, and what do you think you can bring to our company? Gonna steal from it. Sometimes the smallest thing can rewrite the trajectory of your life. For example, the only reason I could think about Dragon Ball Z for five years of my mortal life is I attended a local theater one-act play based on waiting for G Godot, Goddard, G I don't fucking care. I'm... Somebody's gonna say I said it wrong. Where Vegeta and Freezer were fighting on Namek and waiting for Goku. It was so good, it rewrote my brain chemistry permanently. Vegeta's growing despair contrasted with Frieza's dispassionate apathy, desperately trying to ignore the growing realization that Goku might never arrive, might not even exist. The spirit Halloween costumes blending seamlessly with a truly sensitive emotional acting, and I would give anything to attend again, but there will never be another run. I forgot a really important element of this, which is that the actors for Vegeta and Frieza had heels on the whole time. <laughs> this <is> just... <laughs> oh my god, I want to see this! A gentleman so flat and boobless, you could skip him across the water like a prized stone. I can't believe you guys have the courage to say that out loud. I mean, he's just standing right there. Remember, bird watching goes both ways. That's vaguely threatening. Thank you. Just heard someone pronounce arrow A says Elochi, like an Italian pasta. I'm still in shock. Finally, something to go with the garlic bread. Studies confirm suspicions that the cat brains are smaller than they used to be. Any cat owner already knew this. Well, that's an unfair study. That cat is orange. <laughs> I already know this sound, but I want to use this. Transformers is funny because it seems to be a simple niche interest, but in reality, it's like if your Hot Wheels came with Greek mythology. <laughs> I died for your sins. Why? <laughs> Why is this making me laugh harder than I should? When you make a beautiful snow mural and then take a nap with your bike. Oh, how lovely. Somebody should go check on him, though. America's worst nightmare. Florida. Oh my god, you gave the United States of America fucking honors! Oh, uh, oh, oh, hi. Yeah, that, that's the end of this video. Unless you're watching it on a binge thing and I forgot to take this part out, then I apologize for that. I'm very dumb. You know, the plush thing's still going. We had an extension, because we got a comeback, because I drew Sienna with it. I could probably do it again if we hit 400 and use the cute sun elf girl with the tan lines. I know you guys like that one. Don't you fucking lie to me.